I tell you, life, it don't give me a chance. It don't give me a chance. Ah! But I like it. I like it. <laughs> Let me stop playing. Let me stop playing. But. The vibe is massive. It's supernatural. Keep it factual. You know you're maxing bad. Look at the way they hold their chat. Honestly amazing. I want you on occasion. I can do you favors that I know you won't do for. not Sunday but but it's a new week welcome back if you are new thanks for stopping by uh, you know if you like what you see hit that subscribe you know like like notification bell all of that you know the pleasantries the pleasantries so yes it is a new week just got back in from work um, wasn't too bad no I'm lying the morning was very raw. Very raw. So I can't like, oh, it wasn't too bad a day. No, it was very raw. <sighs> so I'm, I'm praying for the afternoon to be, to be chill. I did not get to talk to y'all yesterday. But Sunday was a pretty good Sunday. I spent most of the day with my mom. Little man was by his dad. Um, spent it with my mother we went out to lunch and then we came back we were watching tv and it was just a day just of relaxing and listen i was in my bed by nine something knocked out i forgot to put in my rubber brands for my braces i forgot to charge my phone like i literally like laid there and just like went to sleep went to sleep like somebody KO'd me. I don't know. That's been happening a little bit too much lately. I almost feel like I got a drop seeds or something. That's odd. That's odd. Hmm. But yeah. Yesterday, uh, my mom and I went to this Greek restaurant. She loves Mediterranean food. Like, so any of that Greek and stuff like that. And... Mm, mm, I had Sam. So, like, our appetizer, we got the cold platter. So, we got, like, tzatziki and hummus. And then this eggplant dish. Eggplant dish was... Um, the hummus and tzatziki sauce is really, really good. So it started off, and we're like, oh, food's going to be good. The lies. The lies. Uh, we both got the salmon. It came with, like, potatoes. Did it have any? It was just salmon, potatoes, no vegetable. And it was, like, 
they don't they didn't know what fault was i like i had to actually like um can i get salt and had to like douse it with salt i ate all the salmon i left behind potatoes but i was just like for thirty dollars this and now i make it and now i make it mm -mm. and Nowadays, I realize every time I spend my money, the food be coming out, eh. When I spend other people's money, food be coming out, mwah. I don't, I don't understand it. I don't know. I don't know how it works. But, yeah, so this week, uh, it's going to be a hell of a busy week. We go to Chicago on Friday. Mm-hmm. Chicago. Um, it's going to be a quick trip. I leave Friday, come back Sunday. Um, I was like, oh, maybe I should make my flight, like, late on Sunday. And I was like, nah. I just want, I want to, I want to come back home. Like, I want, I want to be back in my house. I want to be back in my house. So, about to leave in a few, maybe like 10 minutes to go get Little Man. Pick him up a little bit later on Mondays because he has music lessons. So, yeah. Hmm. I'm off all of next week, so I'm excited about that. Excited. Excited. I wish I had some place to go. Like I was doing something. But no. Oh, can I can I say your girl? She's looking. She's looking a little. She's looking a little cute today. <laughs> I was looking cuter yesterday, but I'm looking. I'm looking. <laughs> Let me stop playing. Let me stop playing. But. <laughs> Let me stop playing. Let me stop playing. Ah. Uh, Go downstairs. I think I'm gonna have yogurt. I go get this little boy. I'm gonna come home. It's gonna be homework. That's gonna be a whole ordeal. Maybe if I think about it positively, it'll be positive. You think? I'm gonna be positive. We're gonna have a good time doing homework. Everything will go smoothly. And we won't have any issues. We won't have any issues. I'll let y'all know how that goes. I'll let y'all know how that goes. Positivity. I do have a lot of editing to get done today. Yep. I gotta get it done and edit it and post it for y'all. So that's gonna be tonight. But I have to wake up dumb early. I need to be out of my house by 5 45 6 a.m the latest because i mean to be in long island by eight o'clock yeah yeah Whew. yeah 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 <laughs> Life. It be life in. It be life in. I need some chocolate. I don't feel like myself. 
and it's affecting me drastically. Oh, and I'm heading into work now. I'll do my best to sit down and talk to y'all later and like get it off my chest or Good morning, my loves. So, <laughs> I said yesterday that I was like, oh, I'm going to sit down and Continue straight talk for eight with my people. At 142 and like, you know, New Jersey Turnpike toward Newark International Airport. And tell them, like, you know, what's, 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 what's been going on with me. And I, mind you, I left my house. Like, I don't know how some people do this, like, every single day. I left my house at, like, 6, I want to say, no, I think I left, like, a little after 6. I think I, like, left my house at, like, 6.15. I wasn't back home till 7 o'clock yesterday. So, like, I talked to you all when I was on my way, like, walking to the building for work. And I was, like... You know, it was all full intent of like, yeah, I'm gonna when I tell you I got home and I felt so raggedy. I got home, I didn't even eat dinner. Like the pizza I ate for lunch, that was it. It, it was an amazing, amazing pizza, but that was it. I came home and had a yogurt had a yogurt and I my son insisted on making me tea so I had some tea and that was it I, he wanted me to sit down and watch TV with him so I sat down and, and watched TV with him for a little bit so while I was doing that I edit, edited a short form uh, video to post and then it was upstairs. And of course, that's sitting down, reading to him at least two books. He wanted a third, and I was just like, babe, I do not have the capacity today. Like, I, I don't. I'm tired, baby. And then we prayed, and I went into my, I changed my clothes, and I passed out like passed out like this morning like my alarm went off and I heard it at first and then I slept through all the snoozes like after that slept through all the snoozes after that so I didn't end up getting up this morning till 10 to 6 so I had to be up and quickly so I left the house super late but I'm sorry. I'm just, I don't have it in me. And I haven't had it in me <laughs> for a couple of weeks now. Like, I just, I just haven't. Like, I reached a point in life where I just feel like, literally like, I'm stuck in mud. Like, I'm trapped. And for me, once I'm not happy career-wise... Or once I feel trapped career-wise, I'm not happy. 
Like, I'm not. Granted, do I have a difficult job? I do not. I don't have a difficult job. I, um, I don't have a difficult job. I'm just, I just want something new. I want something new. What I am tired of is driving to New York every day. Like, it was fine at first. I didn't have an issue with the traffic. Why is the left lane of all lanes not moving? At first, I didn't have an issue with the traffic. It was fine. You know, I usually, like, I usually end up just listening to music and enjoying the music, and it's a peaceful ride. It was, like, the traffic has gotten to a point where it's really irritating to me. Severely irritating. And I don't want to do it anymore. I don't want to do it anymore. I really want a remote job that I have the ability to work anywhere, any and everywhere. And I'm not confined. But it's like I've reached, like, not I've reached. The other aspect to it is that I don't know what I want to do. So I thought, or I don't say I thought, my plan was, hey, you know, that typical climb the corporate ladder thing. And I came in, I'm like, hey, you know, I'm going to have everyone get to know my name. I am going to climb the corporate ladder and do whatever, like, like I've done in the past, like, do what I have to do to get where I have to get, and I took the necessary steps, and it didn't, it didn't result in anything, so there's that, and then another aspect of to my, like, not feeling me is I'm used to going on like a personal trip kind of like I'd say at least once every three months I'd say at least at least and I haven't done anything since August (laughs) so my friend she was just like I know you said like you were gonna like chill off the the vacation she's just like but you're like having vacation withdrawals and I am like I I was really sitting down and thinking about it I say that because I feel like I've explained this to you all or said this to you all already that like me going on a trip or a vacation is like literally my the only real time I get a break away from life it's if I'm here home and it's a regular day if I'm working late enough that means I'm getting my son to school well the good thing now is that my dad he's taking on the responsibility of um, getting him up and getting him ready because my dad is like the only person my son does not give trouble to like get up get in the shower get dressed if it's me it's like uh i have to lift him out the shower i mean lift him out the bed and all that kinds of stuff so and then he'll i'll let him take the longest shower that he wants because i'm just like i i don't have the energy like i have a million and one things going on in my mind like him taking a long shower once we get to once we get to school on time that's all that matters so my father gets him up and gets him ready um if i'm home then i take him i take him to school so it's take him to school then go to work i'm at work for sometimes only god knows it knows how long it's gonna be so like with this week it's like it's long days, so I don't get to drop him to school. But then, depending on the time I come back, 
Um, so on a normal day, if I come back and it's in time to pick him up, I'm picking, I'm leaving work, then heading over to school, picking him up, come home. It's immediately homework, immediately, and that's usually a whole, a whole event. And then from homework, he'll watch something, like he'll watch TV. But that's when my mother's either like, oh, uh, you can cook or um, set the table. And you, I, like, I'm just like, can, can I have like just five, like five to ten minutes without not having to do something? So like even last night, all right, I've had this long day and I come in and like, my mother's like, oh great, now that you're home, I can go to church. And my father, like, it's it's always my dad, like, <laughs> it, it baffles my mind that it's always him. He was just like, um, she just got in from like a long day um, you know, I think like she wants like a little breather, and I was just like, you know what? It's fine. I don't. I like. I don't want anyone saying like I kept them from church. Like, it's fine. Like, it's fine. It's fine. Oh, but like my father was one like like give her a little bit of a break. Like, and I'm like, wow, the man. Okay, okay. Um, so that, I, I, I find my, my father's really dope with, really dope with. But I can honestly say that I could do with a break right now, uh, cause like, I just feel stuck in everywhere. I feel stuck in my career. I feel stuck as, at home because I feel like I can't go on vacation. Like, I just feel ooh sun is sunning today okay it's beautiful I show y'all but that involved a lot um oh, maybe I could mm. let me not do no dangerous things ooh I need to be local I need to be local ooh come on come on come on come on let me in yeah um, yeah, definitely. So, yeah, so as I was saying, I feel stuck in my career. I feel stuck as in I have, don't have the ability to go. I have the physical ability right now, the financial. So this school term, my son started private school and private school tuition, the easy it not easy. I'm not getting the help. It is not easy. Like, it's not. So, the money that I would spend on taking a trip, I'll say it, Dave. Okay. Goes to tuition. So, yeah. Just not feeling myself. As as my friend Mercedes would say, I need to rub my butt cheeks in some sand. I really do. I really indeed do. And it's just like I'm going on work trips, and those are cool, but it's work so it's like it can be a long day in itself and the packing involved like with going to Chicago this weekend like on my mind is all the things that I have to get done before I go <laughs> getting there and just just all of that is all of that is on my mind all of that So, like, even editing. I haven't even had time to do any editing. 
So like I'm taking my my work computer to work with me. So I'm like the moments where nothing's going on, I can try and get <clears throat> I can try and get um some editing. I mean not some editing. All of my work work done so that tonight today's Thursday. Yes, today's today's Thursday. So that tonight I can do editing. I can do editing because I haven't been able to do nothing. So like I was supposed to have gotten a vlog out already. That didn't happen. So now I'm gonna have to double up two weeks. Please bear with me. <clears throat> Into one because it's just like last week I had long days. This week I have long days. And then it's like you're coming home coming home from the long days. Like granted yesterday when I came home, I was able to go to sleep because what are we doing, people? What are we doing, people? Um last night I was able to go to sleep because I had taken my computer and I had done stuff at work. On a norm, I don't do that because I don't have the, um, usually don't have the ability to use my computer where I, wherever I am. So I was able to take, because I don't know what this lady's doing, or man, um, I had the ability to use my computer here and get some emails and stuff like that done if i if i hadn't done that yesterday i would then have to come home and do those emails so if i get everything done here today then i have a little little bit of leeway but my mother and they, they're like always like oh um oh, but you have you know uh you don't go to work for that for that long yes i don't go to work for that long but depending on where I'm going, that's at least an hour and a half to two hours to get wherever I'm going. Then I'm there for a short period of time. Okay. But that's another hour and a half to two hours back home. And then if I'm doing all the other things that I'm doing, like dropping him to school, picking him up, homework, that means my afternoon is kind of eaten up by that. So it's kind of like... I have to choose in a way between oh, my neck hurts. Between am I doing stuff with my son or am I doing my work stuff? So it's like something has to be kind of like pushed to the side, and I'm gonna choose for work to be pushed to the side each and every time. Each and every time. So after he's gone to bed, that's when I'm, I have, which is around like eight something, nine o'clock. That's when I have the ability to then sit down at my computer and answer my emails. So it's like, yeah, other people with a regular nine to five is they go to work, they do whatever they have to do in the nine to five and that's it. I don't have a typical nine to five, but then I have to come home and I have to do more stuff. I have activity report to do. If it's kind of like, then that's a choice to do, to go to whether I'm going to do my activity report because that takes time or answer emails. If I do both, then that can be another hour or two hours once I get home. So... As I said, almost every day I end up in a headache now. Like, I came, like, yesterday I'm driving home, like, my head was throbbing. My head was throbbing. And I'm glad my son forced the tea on me because I drank it. And I was, like, it just immediately just, it soothed me. But I was just like this ain't it like this is not it and then I'm debating whether to stay in Chicago an extra day and just 
explore. So many decisions. Oh my god. I mean, no, but it's... <sighs> Are you yeah. So back home from work, a uh, little man is outside playing with our neighbor's grandson. But look what I came home to. One of my coworkers got me a gift. Um, so at work, I got like this little, it's, they call it promotion. It ain't, it really ain't. It's just them trying to feed our egos. It ain't no damn promotion. But anyway, she got me a gift. As a congratulations. It's so nice. Look at it. Hold on. So the it's a place called Sugar Rush. So they have popcorn. And they have all different types of flavors. So I got to choose the flavors. But so I got the peppermint bark, the cookies and cream, and the caramel popcorn. And she got this little note. So cute. It's things like this that make me feel kind of special. <laughs> so I'm heating up my leftover curry from earlier in the week that my mom got me. And this is my like first meal for the day. Because the waffle that my, so my coworker, I forgot to tell y'all. My coworker got me the tea from that boba spot that I ate at earlier this week. He got me the tea and the waffle. Uh, and I was going to eat the waffle. I was like, oh, let me bring it home for Little Man. So I gave it to Little Man. He chowed it down. So I haven't really eaten for the day. Except for like one or two of that waffle. So now I'm about to have me some food. Food. I am so hungry. So, no time to talk no more. It's child time. Good morning. I'm all crooked. <laughs> there we go. So, today is admin and travel day. I leave Chicago tonight. Just got back from... Uh, dropping off little man uh, to school. So I'm going to do some work work right now uh, to get that out of the way. So the rest of the day, it's doing my hair. I need to wash my hair. So as soon as I pick him up, he has half day from school today. I'm going to pick him up. As soon as I get back, wash my hair, start doing it. Um, while doing work work, I'm also going to... Um, start packing because I haven't pick, packed anything yet and I'm like buying stuff from Target to to take with me as well so that's all I have to do so I gotta get going just made myself some tea um, so I'm gonna drink that and get my day going because life doesn't stop
only thing that I was worried about is like, for what? You know, I had such a good walk. Had my AirPods in, the weather, beautiful right now. So I'm sure I'm on the whole solo trip in this trip. I've been, you know, I mean, I've been to like New York and stuff with cream of nature, but it was like business and it wasn't like, we're gonna pay for your dinner, pay for your drink. So I don't know what to expect. I have no idea who's gonna be there. I would hit up Kimberly Sherelle, but I don't, she's not here. I think Casey, Aaliyah, I don't know if you guys know these people, but all my friends, my YouTube friends who I know live in Atlanta are not here this weekend. Hmm? So I feel like God's really stretching me because I always feel like I need a crutch. So God is definitely stretching me. Even, and I also feel like I always come up with excuses not to go live, so. I'm gonna do it one day. I think just the fact that I'm thinking about it now. I have 26 minutes to get through security with the get to. I need you now. <laughs> if you are serious, serious about us. Only Jesus can help. Only Jesus can help. Baby, your love is cold. But I don't feel the trust. Something's not adding up. But you've been up to drinking all my <laughs> Right by your side Why don't you tell me now Oh, why are you calling me late at night Saying you need a ride When you don't tell me why I got a thing about you You got a thing about me too But you keep playing with my feelings Even though you know Got a thing about you We got a thing for each other So don't go wasting what you feeling Don't be dumb, be dumb, be dumb oh, oh, oh. Don't be dumb, be dumb, be dumb oh, oh, oh. Don't be dumb, be dumb, be dumb oh, oh, oh. Don't be dumb, be dumb, be dumb We are in Chicago. We're in Chicago. When I tell you, I passed out on those people's plane. I'm gonna pass out on the people that I'm playing. I, every time my head would jerk, <laughs> I would jerk forward. I'm sure the lady next to me was dying laughing. <sighs> anyway, I am hungry. So normally I would, like go to sleep, but mm -mm, not tonight. I'm hungry, hungry. So, go, but I'll do something light. I'm, I saw a sushi spot, so I'm gonna go there and grab something to eat. And I come back and hit my bed because I need to be up by 5 a.m. their time, which is 6 a.m. my time. So that shouldn't be too rough on me, seeing as how it's only 6 o'clock my time. So yeah, gonna go grab something to eat, come back, go to sleep. My hair would not, like my gray hairs, when I tell you, they aggravate my soul. Like they won't lay down. <sighs> so I don't know what I'm gonna do tomorrow. But let me go get something real quick and come back. My, my foot them hot. I'm ready for go walk on the people them Chicago streets, yes? Ooh, I'm tired. Yeah. Sorry is a word of truth. <laughs> Thank you. 
so good. Mm -hmm. It's excellent. Excellent. You hear the crack? <laughs> Thank you so much. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The kitchen is squatting right now. The kitchen is squatting right now. Okay, that's fine. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. They close in 10 minutes. I need to hurry up. I only got one piece left. <laughs> hotel in my jammies and ready for bed <laughs> I'm ready for bed I'm ready to sleep I'm tired I'm so tired uh, let me turn y'all just a little bit uh, can I can I can I my drop people don't fall on the floor you know anyway, uh, did my bed bug inspection oh lord I need to tilt y'all down a bit Oh, here we go. There we go. We cooking now. The restaurant tonight. Oh, I need a fire. Hold on. Oh, there we go. Anyway, <laughs> the restaurant tonight. Amazing. Like, amazing. The staff were so nice. I got there at like 10, I'd say between like 10 15 and 10 20 and they close at 11 and i was done eating by 10 10 like 10 50 but they were so pleasant so nice the 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 i started off with the i forgot the exact name of it but it was a ceviche delicious delicious and then i had the um the can you handle uh, sushi roll? Mm, as you can, as you saw, I was chowing. Damn, I was. Blah, 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 blah. I was wasting no time, but it was really good. Like I like when I have sushi, and you could tell like the the fish is fresh. Like it's not like some some places I've been to, and like you eat the sushi and it tastes. Like it has this like to me like when I feel like it's like the ingredients are on the older side it feels kind of heavy to me in a way but this was just like just fresh and light and delicious so that was a good start to Chicago so tomorrow I have to be at work for my co-workers coming to pick me up and we're trying to get we're 
getting to work for 6.30. Yeah, so I need to be able to make sure my volume's up high enough for me to hear. Because I'll sleep right through them suckers. Right through. Yeah. But, gonna go to bed. Wake up five o'clock and do what I gotta do uh in the nighttime we are going to dinner like I believe she made reservations somewhere I can't remember the can't remember the place did she tell me the place tomorrow maple and ash a restaurant with maple and ash. Let me look it up. <sighs> maple and ash. My coworker, she usually, ooh, it has four dollar signs. They be wildin'. <laughs> they be wildin'. It has four dollar signs. Now, for my pockets, okay, that's fine if I'm going there on my own time. I'm here for company time. I'm trying to spend the company's money. It says Posh White Tablecloth Steakhouse and Seafood Eatery with a Choice Wine List and a Martini Lounge. Okay. Okay. How far is that from me? I have to figure it out. <laughs> but I'm gonna be dressing up for work anyway, so that's fine. Uh, menu. What is this? They have a seafood tower. Oh, that's a hundred dollars. Bomba. <laughs> oh gosh. Oh, we can get that. We can all share. That would be idea. Porn star martini. Okay. It's not easy. Well, I'll check out the rest of the menu during the day. Ooh, I need to fart again. You ain't hear it. Mm. Silent killers. Uh, so yeah. Menu's pretty long. Wow. Alright. Their brunch? Steak and eggs is $75. Like stuff that's just eggs is $75. That can't be right. That can't be right. Anyway, we'll see you tomorrow. I feel my face breaking out. Uh, I need to go to bed. Let me stop playing. Good night, y'all. I'll see y'all in the morning. In the morning. Y'all gonna see me in the morning. And I'm probably have to change up my battery before I leave out. Remind me. Okay? Thank you. Night, night. Good morning, y'all. <sighs> it's 5.30. I've already bathed. Pretty much dressed. <clears throat> I'm tired. This is why I hate work trips. Because, yeah, I'm in another state. Possibly a state I've never been in before. And I can get all the food content and all that kinds of stuff. You don't mind my morning man voice. It happens. I'm usually working. Like, working, working. And I gotta be there at some ungodly hour. 
I shouldn't be up at this time on a Saturday. <clears throat> Blow my nose. Save some for tomorrow. Do this real quick. That's a moment. These gray hairs be having me straight messed up out here. Like, crazy all cause of them it's like we have come to ruin your life <clears throat> Alright, let's try and do this face.
I'm gonna keep track of my work from. And it's already almost 10 to. <sighs> Granted, I'm pretty much ready, but. battery end up dying uh, so I'm gonna set it up for this battery to for this battery to be charging while I'm gone I just felt stuff dropping off of this. Like, it's the middle of the night. Like, I don't care. There we go. Watch on. Charger with me. Uh, excuse me. Ooh. I needed that though. Um, I'm gonna take my laptop because if I can get some stuff done, that would be awesome. Where is my? I hate when I have stuff and I put it in a certain place and then I look for it and I can't find it. So I had my lip balm yesterday. I don't know where I put it. I don't want to put on just lip gloss, but I think that's what I'm going to have to do. Until I figure out where I put my lip balm. That's better. Your girl looking kind of cute. <laughs> Not gonna lie. Not gonna lie. Alright. Um, spray up. Try and catch me a doctor. I wish like this thing had a little bit more like pockets. It's so, like I could probably organize a little bit better. This doesn't need to be in here. That I need. I'm trying to see would this belt be better? Take my water. Um, what else do I need? That's it. I'm gonna take my lotion. I put that in the back slot. What is that? That's a part of the bag. That's a part of the bag. Um. 
I'm gonna take my deodorant just in case I need to re-up because I should be good. But Let's go with this. If I needed a sweater, it does. If I needed a sweater, it's coming with me in case I get cold. All right. <clears throat> so let's go check out the outfit real quick. light here there we go this is it this keeps coming out of the belt that's cool so yeah we look all right take off the scarf we look extra all right <laughs> is it time let me see what time she let me see what she's doing she hasn't messaged me yet or I don't think I've gotten anything yet check Oops. <clears throat> I'm trying to figure out. You see? You see? I'm trying to figure out if I want to throw on this other necklace that I have. Or if it would be too much. Hold on. Let me find it. <clears throat> Homegirl ain't even left her house yet. She said she finishing up. Trying to decide if this would be too much. I feel like the simple is better. <clears throat> Let me call my mom.
Morning. You weren't. You weren't up. What do you mean? Yeah, I just went to the bathroom. Yeah. Oh wait. Okay. I'm all right. I'm fun getting dressed already. I'm already dressed. Yeah, what time is it? I thought it's an hour earlier there. Yes, no, or an hour behind. Yeah, so it's only 6 o'clock. What time you have to get there for? She said we need to get there for 6.30. She ain't even left her house yet. How far are you from where you have to be? Like, less than five minutes. Are you going <laughs> walk or do you have to take No, I'm not. It's cold outside. Oh, okay, very cold. <laughs> This or no? You can. Yeah, you know, people wear all that stuff for like jewelry. <laughs> okay, so what is a whole day or what? It's supposed to be here. 6.30, ooh, that's early. Exactly, that's why I don't like going on these work trips no more. Yeah, okay. Because you're up mad early in the morning. Yeah. Okay, the only thing about planning your late flight tomorrow, the latest the day that the what flight select to be delayed, so after we think that too. Okay mommy. It's not late. I leave here at three. Oh three. Oh you get here at seven. I thought you were Good morning, you Daddy. Getting here. Oh, I thought you were leaving there at seven. I said good morning. I thought I said good morning. I thought you went to work. I am at work. I look that cute, thank you. Yes. Presentable. Yeah, okay. Anyway, okay. Alrighty. You well you call him later about nine when he should be up. Okay. Alright. Alrighty. Bye. Love you, bye. I tell you, life, it don't give me a chance. It don't give me a chance. Ah! I'm